Front page on the Downing Street website, signalling the importance of such a meeting between two leaders committed to finding a coordinated European approach to the present financial uncertainties. This cooperative initiative highlighted again and again at the Downing Street press conference yesterday afternoon. We discussed the steps that must be taken to reform and stabilize the international financial system, prevent the spread of financial crisis, especially in Eastern Europe, and the action we must take to support businesses and families in both our countries throughout this difficult period. Our discussion of the reforms in the international financial system which will be a subject at the November 15th meeting of international leaders, include reform of the International Monetary Fund, globally accepted standards of supervision and transparency where Chancellor Merkel has taken the lead and cross-border co cooperation at times of crisis. We discussed how we must prevent contagion over the next uh, few days to middle-income countries, including in Eastern Europe. It's vital that the International Monetary Fund plays a central role in supporting these economies we have both agreed to support a new facility for the International Monetary Fund which would draw on additional resources of countries with substantial reserves. We also discussed how we can work together to support families and businesses at this difficult time in each of our countries. We must, all, we must uh, continue to encourage banks to lend. Having recapitalized the banks, we must ensure that the money is used to sustain credit lines on normal terms to solvent businesses. I think it was very good that we found a common toolbox to deal with this at the European le level to cope with this crisis and we had an exchange of views of uh, a number of issues that we feel ought still to be settled. We can only encourage our banks to really make use of uh, what is on offer to them. The interbank lending is not as yet at a stage at a level as we wish it to be and I can only underline what the Prime Minister said. What we want to do after all is to see to it that um, the impact on the real economy is as small as possible. There was a genuine need, said Mr. Brown, for countries to work together on this. I think uh, what both Chancellor Merkel and I are saying is that you will need comprehensive action, not just nationally but internationally, to deal with our problems. Uh, interest rate decisions are a matter for the uh, Bank of England and in Angela's case a matter for the European uh, Central Bank and it's for them to make the decisions. But the comprehensive action that we are talking about includes action that can be taken by governments on their own to deal with the issues that they see about jobs and housing and about energy prices, uh, and then international action where we can come together to build confidence in the financial system. Uh, the central problem has started from irresponsible and sometimes undisclosed lending uh, by institutions who have to take responsibility for their actions. We have now to show that the financial system is being cleaned up in such a way that people can have confidence in it. Their talks come two weeks ahead of an emergency global economic summit in Washington.